And staying on track and field, the 2013 World 100 Meter Bronze Medalist Nesta Carter, now retired, has been given a four-year ban for using the banned drug clomiphene by the Independent Antidoping Disciplinary Panel. Nesta Carter escaped the possibility of an eight-year ban for his second positive drug test, which came out of competition in March of this year. The sprinter, in a statement on Wednesday, said the substance clomiphene was contained in medication prescribed to him while out of competition in February 2021 to manage an ongoing medical condition. Carter previously served a three-month ban in 2017 as a result of a retroactive test for the stimulant methylhexanamine from the 2008 Olympic Games. Kent Gammon, who chaired the three-member disciplinary panel which also comprised of Dr. Jaffet Ford and Heron Dale, said the decision to give the five-time world championship medalist a four-year ban was unanimous. The disciplinary panel, we found that the athlete had been in breach of Article 2.1 of our rules, and therefore we found no factors that would militate against uh, or mitigate against any reduction in the sanctions under 10.2, which is four years period of ineligibility from the date of our findings, which is a essentially the 30th of November 2021. Carter's attorney, Stuart Stimson, says that the decision not to ban his client for eight years is supported by the WADA rules. Well, the panel rightfully, reasonably and correctly accepted our submission that while that was a finding in 2016, it really related to a 2008 test. And this was a retest and it was a retroactive finding. And so if it's a retroactive finding from 2008, that is the proper date from which they should consider it. So therefore, it has been outside the 10-year period stipulated for multiple violations under Rule 10.7.5 of the rules that govern this matter. Carter noted in his statement that he accepted the decision by the disciplinary panel and regretted the failure on his part.